I have animated with over 20 different characters in my time as an animator, but nothing really compares to these Sticky Bones figures. They are very biologically accurate, and are actually made with the sole intent of being painstakingly animated. I like to help with drawing, but no one cares about that. This is the Dark Storm variant. I've used it a lot. And this is the Blue Sky Sticky Bones, courtesy of Animation Ben. These are very cool. I mean, like, how could you not love them? I've animated a lot of random stuff in my videos before. Oh my god! You're Santa! And these figures look like they're just right for it. But we'll get to that later. As I now have two Sticky Bones, I wanted to do some stuff where they interact, so here's a lovely hug. And here are two guys tapping each other up, but it kind of looks oddly gay, so it didn't work out too well. Next, we have an arm wrestle, a piggyback, and some stick spinning. That one isn't gay despite its name. As I have two of these, I thought it made sense to animate a quick dialogue sketch, so let's give that a try. Dude. Why is bacon called bacon, and cookies called cookies, if you cook bacon and bake cookies? Ryan, please not now. I'm trying to sleep! Do clothes in China just say, made down the road? Doc, I, I don't know. The government says we can't leave our house anymore. Oh, I stole the audio from Credless, so uh, yeah, thanks. <laughs> Let's take a second to have a closer look at these. They come in at a fairly high price point at about $130, but you get a lot for that price. They have magnets in their hands and feet, and speaking of the hands, they only have four fingers. But other than the hands, these figures are so accurate to real proportions and have all the same joints as a real person. I would highly recommend them. I use them as a way to practice animation principles, which then translated to all the other characters that I animated later. Now with the boring review out of the way, let's get back to animating. Actually, first, I'm going to try and use them as drawing assistants, as that is their alternate purpose. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not great at drawing. I will just stick with animation. 